destroyed! Run! So, what will happen next? We will find out in the next episode of your favorite science fiction show, Cold Revenge of a Hot Asteroid. Well, as far as this fictional show is concerned, I'm sure the superhero will shatter the asteroid into pieces before it reaches the Earth. But the truth is far, far stranger than fiction, as in reality it will be a matter of huge concern for our planet. Hey friends, so in today's episode, let us explore this world-ending situation and answer a burning question. What if an asteroid hits the Earth? Zoom in! The asteroids hitting the Earth are not limited to science fiction, but are a solid scientific fact known as impact events, meaning a collision of two astronomical objects. And as history has shown us, these events have played a significant role in shaping our world right from the formation of Earth's moon to bringing water on Earth to even leading to several mass extinctions. But the scary part is, these events are not a thing of the past, but asteroids are hitting the Earth every day. Yes, every day! Earth is bombarded with more than 100 tons of dust and sand-sized articles. And not only that, about once a year, a car-sized rock approaches our planet. But fortunately, our atmosphere burns them down to ashes before they can reach us. And at times, some of them even change their direction midway as it happened on January 2022, when a giant asteroid named Asteroid 7482-1994 PC-1, which was estimated to be three times bigger than New York's Empire State Building, safely passed the Earth. This event was classified as a potentially hazardous asteroid due to its size and relatively close passing from our planet. So, we should consider ourselves lucky to dodge it as an asteroid of this size won't come crashing towards Earth until the next 600,000 years. But there is another threat lurking over Earth's head. Yes, a big concern for now is the asteroids the size of a football field called meteorites that tend to crash our surface every 2,000 years. These giant fiery balls of rock and metal can shoot towards Earth at the speed of nearly 30 kilometers per second and can pass our atmospheric layer unharmed. And if that happens, before we could even react in less than 3 seconds, there is a 3% chance that it could hit a populated region. In that case, this fireball will destroy everything in the radius of 3 kilometers and cause massive damage to properties and the population within the 7 kilometer radius. And if it would have been made of radioactive elements, then there is a chance of it spreading radioactive radiation around its impact region. But fortunately, the losses caused by these few hundred feet long asteroids won't be as bad as getting hit by an asteroid as giant as 10 kilometers big that was responsible for wiping out the entire species of dinosaurs. Yes, if an event like that repeats today, then no doubt within seconds of impact, the shock waves coming out will wipe out a huge number of human population and animals. The scattered debris will make a ring around our planet, which will eventually 
rain back down on the surface, causing massive fires at different regions of the earth. The smoke coming from this fire along with dust caused by the shock wave will rise to the atmosphere and block the sunlight. So, due to lack of sunlight, there will be a drop in temperature leading to the extinction of many plants and animals and due to lack of food, the human race will come to an end as well. This means we would face the same fate as the giant animals who once ruled the planet. But fortunately, the probabilities of an asteroid crushing our surface are pretty small. Yes, NASA has tracked 90% of the near-Earth asteroids that are at least a half mile wide and according to researchers, none of these asteroids have the good chance of hitting Earth. Phew! Trivia time! Did you know asteroids are rich in minerals and water? Yes, scientists believe they delivered some of these vital elements to Earth and kick-started life. Hope you enjoyed today's episode. Until next time, it's me, Dr. Binox, zooming out. Huh? Oh, never mind.